finished by man. With Tower Bridge for a backdrop, members of the English Folk Dance and Song Society hold a festival to celebrate Midsummer's Day. Officially, half the summer's gone already, hardly cause for celebration, but it's a chance to enjoy one of the most popular expressions of that British yearning for the good old days. Another event which gave full rein to nostalgia was this coaching marathon in Dorset. Eight old-time coaches recalling the days when horsepower wasn't packed away beneath a bonnet, when driving was the art of controlling a four in hand. In the heyday of coaching, the skill of the professional was often taken up by the sporting gentry. They competed regularly in events like this. Two hundred and fifteen years ago, the first mail coach ran from Bristol to London, averaging seven miles an hour for the distance. Even though the ordinary stagecoaches were often faster, it does seem a leisurely pace. But what a view of the countryside! What a joy on a fine summer's morning! Finishing point, the Royal County Showground near Poole. The winning trophy goes to the team driven by Sir Dimmock White of Hampshire. You know, the old days certainly had something. <laughs>